Welcome to the channel, ladies and gentlemen. My name is the British Eagle, and today we are diving, flying, soaring into a brand new episode of Pokemon Adventures Red Chapter. Yes, again, this beautiful game that we are playing, which is also the difficult game. And I say difficult for a reason because uh, we have lost Mons every episode. Thankfully, it's not a Nuzlocke, as I've said for the a millionth time. But you're probably looking at the screen thinking, British, why in the heck in the freaking frack are you in front of a Pokemart? instead of the Pokemon Center or instead of the route you're about to progress in. And I'll show you why right here. As you can see, we have one Lemonade available to us. That is it. We don't have Soda Pops. We don't have any other healing items because I'll show you my team real quick. We have done some grinding and it took a lot of healing along the route unless I wanted to run back to the Pokemon Center, which I decided I did not want to constantly do every five seconds. So we have a Dratini here. Ane the Dratini, level 23. Uh, rocking out with Dragon Rage, Leer, Thunder Wave, and Twister. Dragon Rage, we got at about 15 or 16. Took a little while, but finally our grinding uh, issues were solved, sort of, because it took us a long time to get to that level. I stopped at 23 because it took way too long. We got Platypus at 30, Kenshin 30, Try Guy 31, Sparky 30, and KD 30. I'm not doing a full team recap because, well, you should already know the team by now. And if you don't, go back and watch the previous episodes. They are stupendous. So let's go ahead and buy some drinks here. Uh, we got the money for it, so I'm going to go ahead and do this. We're going to buy quite a few drinks here. We're going to buy 10 fresh waters. We're going to buy... Uh, we'll go 15 soda pops. We'll go... Uh, 15, 15 lemonades makes sense. And then what I'm also going to do... We'll probably have to start buying Moo Moo Milk soon. Then what I'm going to do is I'm going to sell some items here... Oh, I did find a spell tag. When I was uh, looking to see where the next route is, I found that. So cool. About boost ghost type moves. Anyway, we're going to sell our HP up that we found in the last episode. Big Club could be good. It doesn't really sell for much, so I'm not going to sell it for nothing. Um, And I think that's it. So we got some money back. Let's buy some items here. Um, We can buy Great Balls. How many do we have? You know what? Let's just buy five just to be safe here. I think we have quite a few, but, um, ooh, we can buy X items from here. Pretty cool, pretty cool. Um, we don't need really healing items. Actually, no, we do need some paralyzed heals, because we got paralyzed a lot, and I think we ran out. Um, you could buy ethers from the Mart? I just noticed that. Did I mention that in a previous episode? I feel like I didn't. Uh, that's kind of crazy. Um, all right. Well, other than that, we are good to go. So I did run around, and as I was grinding, I act... Oh. Let's make sure we fix this glitch right here. Step in the store, step out of the store. Okay, so I did figure out as I was running around grinding my Dratini or my Ane up to level 23, I did figure out the next route where we're supposed to go, and it is the route that was blocked previously by Martha. Now, Martha is up here on Route 5, and I believe it's over this way. So over here, Martha was lying here in the road and would not let us go past. But now we can move on. So let's make sure our team is in the right order. Looking good. Ane's heal. We're going to use Ane in this episode. Try and level it up a little bit. And now we're going to head west over to a new route. So this is kind of cool. Is this Martha? No, it's Grunkle. Good old Grunkle. You can't forget about him. I lost my house and my kids to gambling. I need to get them all back. You probably should work on that. Route 8 is a new route, so let's see if we can... Ooh, cutscene. Okay, there's some twins here. And there's this. Tee, a new visitor, the unsuspecting fool. Chapter 11, War Turtle Wars. Yes! Are we going to fight our other rival, Pokemon Trainer Green, which in this is somehow blue, which... Whatever. However the game wants to do it, I guess. But, yo, that's going to be so freaking sweet if that's if that's what's happening. Also, guys, you'll probably notice that there's a lot of cut trees and a lot of boulders that I could smash. Unfortunately, I did look it up in the guide because I wanted to make sure I didn't miss anything. You don't get cut and rock smash till later on in the game. So, unfortunately, we are not going to be able to cut stuff, really. There we go. Okay, we're getting away from that battle. Um, also, double battle. Let's put... I want Try Guy to get some action. I feel like Try Guys should go up front here. So we're going to battle these twins here. Let's let's do it. Gloria Tyler says, "We're the Tyler sisters. Take our taste our deadly combo." <laughs> All right, well let's see what the Tyler twins have. It is a double battle. We got Ane and we have Try Guy up front. So let's see 
Level 28 Jinx and Persian. By the way, guys, I could have done more grinding. I know I said in the last episode I was going to do a bit more grinding. The reason I didn't, honestly, was just because of the fact that I just... It took so long to grind up, um... To grind up, uh... Uh... Friggin' Ane that I just... Oh, no, that's one shot. What am I doing staying in? Ice Punch one shot. Yep. And it got a crit. Oh, nice. Thanks, Jinx. Thanks. Um, what I was going to say was that it took a long time to level up Ane, which seemingly seems a little pointless right now. Completely didn't think it would have an ice move. I'm going to be honest. I didn't think it would. But in this game, I need to stop thinking that these Mons at low levels don't have good moves. They all have good moves. So, British, if you stop thinking that, you'll pass. Sounds good. All right. Well, anyway, that's fine. We've got our... Uh, oh, Flame Burst hits both of them. I didn't know that. All right. Um, we'll go for a Fury Attack on the Persian. I want to take that out first. One. Two. Ooh, I got a crit on the second hit. Three. Three times. That's not bad. We'll take that. Mean look is coming. All right. It's keeping us in the battle. We cannot run away. All right. That's fine. Defense harshly fell. Flame Burst is going to hit both of them. So first, it's going to be Persian. Persian is defeated. Very nice. And Jinx is going to get hit for quite a bit of damage. If it wasn't split, it would have one-shot, but Sunlight is strong. That's all right. Volpix will get a second round, or KD will get a second round to go with a Flame Burst. We're going to go with a Peck to try and take it out. And it actually does. Nice job, Try Guy. Um, I probably should have switched out knowing it had Ice Punch, but it's all good. Wow, you've defeated our undefeatable combo. 5,376. Oh, my gosh. All right, so we do have revive, so I feel like I shouldn't waste my time running all the way back. Let's just heal up Ane, revive Ane, and let's just use some of the items that we purchased. Uh, fresh water, we'll use that on Ane to heal up. Ane, I don't want you to die out on us and not be here to hang out with us, so we're going to just revive you. Um, okay, so there's some people there. There's an item over here. It is a revive. Oh, perfect. We just used a revive, so that actually works out pretty well. I feel like, oh, there's another twins battle down here. Okay. Um, you know what? We're going to stick with this duo again. I think we can do this this time. Let our Pokemon sink their venoms into you. Papu says that. All right, Papu. Let's see what you got. Papu and Nina sent out Jigglypuff and Clefairy. All right. Jiggly, Clefairy. All right. So, Ane, let's go with Dragon Rage on the Clefairy. And then we're going to use Pack also on the Clefairy. I want to double team one Mon at a time. Dragon Ra It doesn't... Oh, because it's Fairy. Oh my gosh, I forgot. That's a typing in this game. Fairy's actually in this gen. Oh my gosh, that sucks. And it just disabled Dragon Rage. Okay, so there's no point in Ane being in here because, well, you can't do anything. Uh, let's go into Platypus. Oh, by the way, guys, I have a cool thing to show you about my... Uh, my platypus that I got off screen. It's a good and a bad thing. Um, and you'll see in a second here. Let's so go for wake up slap. Did a decent. Oh, got a crit. That's why. Double slap. Double slap. That's fine. Two hits. So here's the good news and bad news. Good news. We learned drain punch. It's a fighting move. It's stab, which is awesome uh, because we're part fighting. It's 75 power, 100% accuracy, and it drains health. So when you do damage to the opponent, it gives you half of the health that you damage the opponent by and gives it back to yourself. So you recover half the damage you did to the opponent, basically. Um, I did get rid of Body Slam. I know that was probably a silly decision, but Body Slam was really good, but it wasn't Stab. I wanted the Stab fighting move, and I know that uh, Body Slam's stronger than Dream Punch, but this is Stab, so it's going to get that boosted attack power, and also this could heal us at the same time. I love Ice Beam for the diversity. I love Aqua Jet because it's a Stab move as well, and it's priority, and Hypnosis is really good, so... I couldn't get rid of... I had to get rid of Body Slam, sorry. So, Drain Punch, and then we're going to go for a Fury Attack on this one. We actually hit on Jigglypuff. One. Two. Or, Attack lands, I should have said. Three. Jigglypuff is defeated. Very nice. Goodbye, Jiggly. Goodbye. Ana gains some experience, so does Platypus. Drain Punch, here we go. The very cool move. I freaking love it. Doesn't do much, but we get some health back. I'll take it. All right. Wake up slap, that's fine. You can do that. Doesn't really do much. We're going to go for an Aqua Jet and a Pack to finish this thing off. We are, we have priority and we are fast, so we kill. And there we go. Clefairy is defeated. Very nice. I'll take that. 
Good experience for everyone. Okay, experience. What? We've lost! That can't be! 5,376 again! Oh my goodness. This money is in insane. I want to see what's around here. A Meowth? Okay. Oh, come on. Are we serious? Now I get away. Really? You guys are going to make me waste all of my items? Uh. Alright, so let's talk to these two over here. I like dogs. Bazinga! I don't. I actually love cats. They're so sassy. Oh my god, Sheldon, you're so annoying. Can you just leave me alone for one second? Wow, that's... She's not happy with you. Yo, how about a match? I'll take that as a yes! And Ivysaur comes out. That's interesting. So, this is a storyline fight. Okay, Black Belt Knuckles will like to battle. Sends out a Primeape. Okay, Ane's coming out. Um, I'm gonna go for this. Goes for Screech, misses Dragon Rage. Does 40. It doesn't even do half. Oh, man. Oh, man. That's gonna hurt. Uh, we hung on. I was hoping Dragon Rage would do half so we could two-shot this thing, but doesn't look like we can. I'm gonna heal and hope that he doesn't get a crit or goes for, like, something and misses, and then we'll go for Dragon Rage. Goes for assurance again. Ugh. Yeah, we don't have speed. Okay. I don't want to lose... I don't want to use another revive, so let's go ahead and switch out into Kenshin, the Ivysaur, to match the storyline here. So let's go ahead and see if we can do that. Assurance... And we're right on par with this level. Nice. So let's go for a Razor Leaf. Goes for a Seismic Toss to do exactly 30 damage. That's pretty solid. All right. Not bad. We're going to go for a Razor Leaf. We do hit. And that takes out the Prime A. Very nice. Goodbye. On against 478. So does Kenshin. Player defeated. Black Belt Knuckles. Oh, man. Got some decent money. I'll take that. Very nice. Man, I'm not cut out for this. Time to become a monk. What? Wow, that was so awesome! You must be an excellent Pokemon trainer! I got so excited from just watching you! I like this music, though! This is dope! W well I try! <laughs> too bad, if only you had some Pokemon items to make your Pokemon even stronger! Items? Tee <laughs> do you want to buy some from me? I I'm sure they're great, but... You don't want- you don't want my items? No, no, I do, but- Tee <laughs> perfect. That'll be 1,000. Glad to be doing business with you. Got the power items. All right, so we got some power items. Pretty sick. Probably X items then. Well, I gotta go now. Bye. Very interesting. <laughs> I can totally tell that she really likes me. She's definitely my type. Yikes. Uh, I don't know if that's the case, bud. Uh, any hidden items? Nope, there is no hidden items. Uh, well... That was interesting. Did not expect that. Uh, all right, so let's go ahead and heal here. So we heal Ane up. Uh, let's also heal Kenshin, just to be safe. Uh, we got a ton of money, so I'm not as worried now about uh, using healing items. So we're going to need uh, Moomingle probably pretty soon, now that we're in the 30s. Uh, let's talk to this guy. Although loneliness has always been a friend of mine, I'm leaving my life in your hands. What? Pidgey, thank you for letting me run away. People in Kanto are a lot more advanced than the people from Johto. Kanto citizens believe in evolution, while people from the Johto region believe in gods. Interesting. Okay. <gasps> ah! Huh? This is my chance to test out the item that I just brought. Let's go, Pikachu! Okay, Pikachu, power item! Huh? Huh? Wait, Pikachu, you need more items! Grr, something tells me I just got duped. Please, get rid of it. Eee! Yeah, what did her power items do to Pikachu? Now, can I catch this or... I'm just gonna go for a Dragon Rage. This goes for a Horn Attack. Does good damage. Okay, I'm gonna go for another one. And we kill it. Grr, that girl better wish that she'll never... Uh, we'll never see her again. I should heal my Pokemon in the Pokemon Center. They seem kind of tired from the last battle. Before I do that, let's snag this item. We are in Celadon? Or I missed the... I sped up, so I missed what it said for the town. I'm assuming it is, right? Hold on. Let me check real quick. Celadon. Yes, it is Celadon City. Very cool. We're in Celadon. Nice. I'll take that. Let's go heal up our team and... Uh, yeah. Oh, Professor Oak. Ah, British! I did not expect to bump uh, into you here in Celadon City. Dare I ask how you, you are doing, British? Oh, yeah, I'm fine. I can't possibly tell him that I got ripped off like a dope. 
Hey, Professor Oak, take a look at my Ivysaur. Ah, I'd say you're doing great to think that a timid Bulbasaur would evolve into this. Wonderful, simply wonderful. Take a look at my Polyrath. I'm impressed. Polywell can only evolve into a particular evolution stone. These stones are scarce to come by. You know, British, Green's Charmed has evolved into a Charmeleon. Now that only leaves Squirtle. Squirtle? Yeah, it was one of the three Pokemon that I was researching, but never mind about that. Uh, Professor, what was Squirtle's trainer like? Hmm, I don't know. You see, Squirtle was actually stolen from my lab. What? I didn't know she stole him from the lab. Stolen? Well, I got some other errands to do, British. I'll see you around. Don't forget to fill you up your Pokedex. Huh. So now we're starting to learn a little bit about her backstory here. So she stole the Squirtle that she has. <coughs> Sorry about that. Anyway, uh, after that loud sneeze, sorry if that uh, did anything to your ears while you were listening to this video in your headphones. Your Pokemon's health is back to... Yeah, that's... Thanks, Nurse Joy. Uh, level 23. All right. So let's go ahead and continue. We've healed up. We saw Professor Oak. Let's see what else there is to do in this town. It's looking pretty familiar, but let's go see if we can go talk to people. Ooh, an Alakazam. I'm planning to teach my Alakazam to use Psybeam. Get it? Get it? Gangnam style, uh. Oh, shut up. Really? He's gonna teach his Alakazam Psybeam because he's a psychic Pokemon? Wow. Pirate of the Seven Seas. I'm on vacation with my sister. You see that guy over there? His name is Yu Tao. I hate him. I'm going to break them up because I'm such a little brat. I brought my younger brother along with for vacation. I hope my boyfriend doesn't mind. <laughs> what a total magmar block. I wanted to have a romantic vacation with Rory. But her brother's continuously butting into our intimate moments. Well, it does suck. Let's talk to this guy. I'm flat out broke. I guess that means no more slots for me. I think I don't need this coin case anymore. Obtain the coin case. Very cool. Let me give you a piece of advice. Don't ever get addicted to gambling. Well, thank you. That's good advice. Hello, welcome to Celadon City Hotel. Hello, welcome to Celadon City Hotel. Okay, you say the same thing. Tch, only the cool people are allowed in this hotel. Aren't you a bit too old to care about cool, you fossil? Wow, Red, chill out, my dude. Oh my gosh. Aren't you a bit too young to be talking back to your elders? Go run to your mom, little boy. Aren't you a bit too ugly to have a beautiful name like Bella? Wow, that that was a brutal conversation. All right, yikes. Ooh, yikes. Uh, that wasn't great. Well, anyway, what's over here? Nope, we can't swim. We don't have surf. Um... The game corner's there. Ooh, the department store. Can we get some good TMs here? I hope so. Uh, let's see. Welcome to the Pokemon department store. All right, please give me some good TMs. I need some TMs to teach uh, Dratini. I sell TMs. Ooh, Calm Mind, Hyper Beam, Brick Break, Flame Charge. Oh my gosh. Okay, they're 9,000 each. Wow, that is a lot. All right. Um... What do you sell? Okay, so you sell the same kind of... Well, no, you sell uh, actual items. How many great... I think we're good on great balls. Let me just check really quick before I start buying all these TMs. Uh, 16 and 23 Pokeballs. Yeah, okay. So we're we're definitely good to buy an item or two. So I'm kind of thinking Flame Charge sounds pretty good to me. Brick Break would also be good. Um... Mmm... I feel like I should wait on those. I, I really need some more money, honestly. I can't afford to spend all my money right then and there on just two moves. Flame Charge, which are, we already have Flame Burst for Vulpix. Um, Evolution Stone. Oh, ooh, we can make Vulpix into a uh, Ninetales. And uh, Ice Stone. Ooh. That's pretty cool. So we have Vulpix and I think... Th oh, wait. We can use a uh, Thunderstone to get a Raichu. Very cool. I'm thinking we want to use that now, don't we? Because, I mean, Pikachu already has gre a great move set for a Raichu. Or for when it becomes a Raichu. What other moves would we want to teach it? Uh, we don't want to go in there. So, will it let me use it? No use. I can't use it on Pikachu. <gasps> Wow, I just wasted my money. KD can evolve into Ninetales. So here's my thing. I want to wait for KD a little bit. I'm going to do some research and make sure we're not missing out on Flamethrower or something else. Real quick, I just want to check its moves. 
Flame Burst is 70 power. Confuse Ray, Faint Attack is 60, and Will O Wisp obviously burns them. Honestly, KD's moveset's pretty good for me to evolve it, but I do want to wait. I'm going to hold on to the Evolution Stone for now. At least we have it, um, but I am definitely curious about doing that in the future. So, what can we buy here? Okay, no way. That's going to cost way too much. Uh, let's see. X attacks, X defense. I'm good. No thanks. Uh, let's continue upwards. What's up here? People talking? Uh, let's see what you got to say. I came here to protect the world with my Exodia. <laughs> Yu-Gi-Oh reference, nice. I can see it in your eyes. I can see it in your smile. You're all I've ever wanted with your arms open wide. Is that a song or something? Hi, I'm from GameSleek. We are currently holding a Pokemon drawing competition. All you have to do is submit a drawing of some Pokemon. The winner will get a free Pikachu. Interesting. Uh, okay, well, that's kind of cool. Was that a Ro Is that a Rotom on the wall, the picture? It's a pretty picture of Pokemon. It looks like it's feeling good. Can't tell what that is. The only reason I say Rotom is the red head, but... All right, we're going to wait on the TMs. I think we're fine. We don't need a fire or fighting move right this moment. So uh, we're going to hold off, but they are good moves. I will take that. I can never get sick of this cafe. This coffee tastes great. You should try it. Yum, this omelet is good. Hello, may I take your order? Our food here makes Pokemon happy. 5,000? No, my god. Wow, that is too much. Hello, we sell delicious mal malasada here. 5,000. All status problems. That's really nice, but way too expensive. 5,000 to heal all status problems? Nah, I'm good. Um, oh. Well, it looks like someone's... Tr I, I don't want to jump into that cutscene yet. I want to explore everything first. And there's an item back there. Let's see if we can go snag that. Behind the... Oh. Oh. Weird. How do we get back there? Uh Oh, you have to surf? No. Wait, really? There's the gym. Can we go really... Oh, no. We can't go around that way. Okay, interesting. Um, What's down here? There's... Is this the same thing I was just... Yeah, it's the same thing. Okay. Um, I mean, I guess we're good to go. Our team is looking healthy and ready to battle if we need to so let's do it let's go talk to this person this uh rival of ours hurry hurry step right up it's the biggest pokemon item sale ever everything must go this looks like a good item wow is that a super rare candy the rare candy that increases your pokemon's level by 50 stages the price is just right i'm getting a heart attack just thinking about it help me lan uh help i'm getting a heart attack oh god i was hoping i'll see you again uh-oh, I hate returning customers. Uh, yeah, you better run. Because I'm chasing you because you sold me some faulty items. <sighs> stop, thief, stop. She can swim? Teehee, bye-bye. She actually has a Pokemon? That little thief, I gotta find her. Where could she be? Yeah, where would she... I mean, I can't swim to follow her, so... What am I supposed to do? Um, okay. This is part of the game where I don't, like, it kind of sets you up. Oh, wait. Oh, I thought I could go behind the house there. No. Um. Can I go through here? No. Wait, is there a door in the back of this house? Ah, uh, no. Okay, let's talk to the grandma first. These three kids here are offense. I take care of all of them. I feed them, bathe them, and also teach them. It's tiring, but it's worth it. My husband used to help me out as well until he ran off with a younger woman. Oh, God. Well, there is a doorway, so I can follow her back there. Um, all right, let's go upstairs first. I want to see what people are saying, what we can get from people. We're from PETA. We care about Pokemon. Yep. All right. Oh, the, the stairs are over this way. Okay. Go this way. I'm assuming those other two characters are just going to say, yep, so. <gasps> Squirtle, Charmander, Bulbasaur. Squirtle! As a thies a thies toad? I think I'm going to cancel my hack. Pokemon Adventure Red Chapter, leaving everyone feeling high and dry. Oh my gosh. What is that? Cosplayer. We love to cosplay. It's literally blue, red, and green. Oh my gosh. Your costume looks horrible. What? You want to know where I got this yukata from? I got it from Floral City. We love to cosplay. Oh, that's so weird. Why are you in your underwear? 
Uh, why are you in clothes? Yes, because I'm the weird one. <laughs> wow, I love it. Oh, can I can't go upstairs? Huh. Weird. All right, it won't let me upstairs. That's interesting. I love that there's a Charmander, Bulbasaur, and Squirtle just chilling around here. Char! All right, let's head out back. Let's see if we can chase down our other rival, uh, Pokemon Trainer Green, even though in this game they call Blue Green. I'm never going to get over that. It's going to drive me crazy. I really don't like it. Maybe I got a bad ROM or something. I don't know, but... Ooh, now we can get the item that I was looking at, which is a Link Stone. Very cool. Any new uh, Pokemon that we can catch out here? Anything good? A neat arena. We can get a Moonstone, so that might be something to look into. What else can we get? Neat arena. Oh, great. Uh, oh, it's raining around here. Have you seen a girl in a black dress? Yes. Yes, I did. I saw her running off to Route 8. All right, thanks. It's her in disguise, isn't it? Team, my disguise worked. I love the music. I knew something was up. Where's my thousand money? I'm so, so sorry. I know the items I sold you were fake, but I didn't do it for the money. I did it because I wanted to see you again. Can you ever forgive me for playing such a mean trick on you? N now, now, please don't cry. But I've been so bad and I'm about to get worse. Oh, snap. She's ready to battle us. Let's see what our rival... Pokemon Trainer Blue has in this, of course. Jigglypuff and War Turtle. Even though she wrote on a Lapras. Level 33 and 34. Are you serious? Wow. All right, so we're going to switch out. Uh, let's go into... Let's go into Kenshin. And then we'll go ahead and attack Jigglypuff with Fury Attack. Ani, that's enough. Go, Kenshin. Ivysaur versus War Turtle. Ivysaur versus War Turtle. All right, here we go. For your attack, one, two. Okay, two times is not great, but that's okay. Body slam, body slam. Oh my gosh, that did a lot of damage. Uh, Razor Leaf hits both, and we're gonna go for another Fury attack on the Jigglypuff. War Turtle goes for a second uh, protect. By the way, I really like his animation or his uh, sprite in this game. It looks a little bit better. I don't know why I feel that way, but it just does. Oh no, now we're attracted to Jigglypuff. Oh great. All right, so we're going to go with a Razor Leaf. That's only going to hit Jigglypuff because of the Protect on War Turtle. But it's enough to take out Jiggly with a crit. I think that was necessary. Very nice job, Kenshin. Okay, 184 for each. Uh, let's go for a Razor Leaf, and then let's go for a Fury Attack. One. Two. Three. Four. Oh, we got a crit. Bye. Very nice. And do we outspeed? We do not. It goes for an Aqua Tail. Stab Aqua Tail does okay damage for it not being very effective. Razor Leaf should be a one shot. It's super effective. And War Turtle goes down with a crit. Again, back to back crits. We'll take that. Very nice job. And Ane gains some experience. Try Guy and Kenshin does as well. Defeated Rival Blue. Eek! I need to get out of here. 10,506 money. Oh my gosh. You didn't think I would see that coming? You gotta be more careful trying to outsmart a trainer with two badges. Two badges? Now take this! Ah! Looks like I overdid it. Oh well, she'll wake up soon. Meanwhile, I'll just take my money back. Her name is on the wallet. Hmm, so her name is Blue. I might as well record the data of her war turtle as well. <laughs> Stay out of trouble now. <laughs> Teehee, I could have easily escaped, but when he mentioned the two badges, let's just say there are things that money just can't buy. Did she steal our badges? End of War Turtle Wars chapter. Wow. My trainer badges, they're gone. I couldn't have dropped them. That girl blue. She must have stolen them. Oh, she is so gonna regret it. Do you want to play as blue? Yes, I do. This is so awesome. I love this. Bonus chapter, Blue's Tale 1. Ooh, a few hours earlier. Oh. <gasps> This is the Team Rocket hideout. According to my sources, this is where the disc is kept. <laughs> uh, I feel like we're only given missions like searching for the Phantom Pokemon because they don't believe in our capability in fighting. I'm confident this notion of the Phantom Pokemon is a ruse to keep us busy. The Phantom Pokemon is real. I saw a glimpse of it back in Pallet Town, Town's forest. 
Anyway, the disc that the weird science guy made w uh, would help us seek out the Phantom Pokemon. Let's hope so. Ooh, we get to play as Pokemon Trainer Blue. This is awesome. Teehee, bingo. Who's there? Uh-oh, I caught. I'm caught. Time to spring in action. Ah! Ah! They're right. They have no capability in fighting whatsoever. Okay. Oh, uh, we don't get to see her team. Are you freaking kidding me? Okay. Well, here's the deal, guys. I'm going to save it right here. We're going to call that an episode. Um... We're going to leave it on a cliffhanger. For the next episode, we are going to play as Pokemon Trainer Blue. Really, it's green, but that's fine. Uh, Pokemon Trainer Blue. And in the next episode, we're going to explore the Rocket Hideout. Then we're going to go back as Pokemon Trainer Red and hopefully get our badges back from her after she stole them both from us. How dare she? Um, but as always, I hope you guys enjoyed the episode. Hit the like button down below. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. I'm trying to hit that 200 sub goal. And we're only five subs away as of today's recording session. So, uh. As always, continue to spread those positive vibes like butter. I'll catch you guys in the next episode. But until next time, I'm out. Peace.